So, in the last video, guys, we got our first ever gold viper weapon. We've got the Type 63 here as our first gold viper weapon. Now, unfortunately, we're not even close to being able to get our second gold viper weapon. So, today is not going to be an episode of the Road to Dark Ether series. Uh, yeah. Level 13, we've got level 21, level 32. Guys, we need to get these guns up to at least rank 50 each in order to be able to get gold on them. It is absolutely insane the amount of grinding we're going to have to do over and over again in zombies to be able to get these things up to the point where we can get gold. Because I'm going to be honest with you guys, I'm not touching multiplayer with a freaking 10 inch barge pole. It is not happening. I very much prefer the zombies in this game. Season 1 is just around the corner. It's coming some point in December. December 10th or 11th seems to ring a bell. I don't bloody know. All I know is season one is coming in December and there's supposed to be some new content coming out for zombies. So today, my friends, what I figured we could do is just a high wave run. That is right. Today, we are going to be attempting a high wave run. Now, what I would define as that is maybe trying to go for wave 50 and trying to get a successful exfil on that as well. At the same time, we're going to go ahead and maybe grind out a whole bunch of different guns as well. So, what I think we're going to do is... Uh, let's go for the M16. Sod it. We need to rank it up, so let's get it done. Now, what I would ideally like to have happen is we get triple pack guns. We get ourselves... Top tier, one to standard weapons, and ideally, a ray gun, okay? Getting a ray gun is going to be key to being able to exfil at the very high wave runs, okay? So, yeah, it's going to be a great time. So, without further ado, it's time to punch down some zombies. Wow, wave three, once again, we've already got armor. That's going to help us massively, guys. Especially at this early stage. How you doing, buddy? Oh, tomahawks. You know what? I kind of want this. Boom. <laughs> I love tomahawks and zombies. I think they're fantastic. Sweet. All right. A little bit of double pointage to uh, boost our points up a bit. And uh, we're going to go by Stamina Up and Juggernog. All right. I mean, to be honest, this is just how I roll in this map. I buy Stamina Up and Juggernog first. It just makes sense. Let's not forget. Oh, wow. I've got 200 points because I had uh, double points there. <laughs> fantastic. All right. Come on then, Jug. There you are. What a fantastic thing to get. All right, there we go. Another 300 points. Love to see it. Hey! We got some freaking sight challenges on the go as well. Didn't even realize. Gotta be honest with it. Didn't even realize I had a different sight on. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. Going for the sight challenges and zombies is like a low-slung MVP way of getting XP. End of this round, I think we're going to go for power. Pack a punch and maybe start hitting the mystery box just a little bit. I feel like the earlier we're able to do that, the better things are going to be in terms of us actually staying alive, you know? As the waves progress, these guys are about to become freaking serious buttholes, all right? So, yeah. Just got to be careful, huh? Alrighty, guys. The time has come. The question is, do we have enough points to actually do this entire thing? That's the real question. All right, so let's go and blow this up. That's 1,500 points. One of these days, I'll actually do the calculations so I can actually figure out just how many points I need to do these various things. Okay, I'm pretty sure I've got more than enough to do this entire thing uh, in that we have enough to get ourselves up to power, turn it on, get the teleporter going, and then get some other stuff going. Yeah, we need 5,500 points in order to do this thing. 500 to go down the Dark Ether Tunnel, and then 5,000, of course, to pack a punch my weapon. All right, so thankfully, the Dark Ether Tunnel is on the right-hand side of the map, along with Jug, which is pretty darn fantastic. All we got to do is pop over there and see what's what. However, we do have a little bit of time, so one thing I do like to do is, uh, yeah, we like to kill these little things. You never know. You sometimes get extremely good stuff out of it. I've even heard reports... I've even heard reports that you can get a ray gun out of these on extremely rare occasions. So can you imagine if we got that today? Like, that'd be pretty freaking sick, right? But look at that, guys. We've got a free bison. That's pretty nice. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and break that. I'm going to break that. Maybe we get something out of it. No, we've got some ammo. I guess that's pretty cool. We'll go ahead and break this one as well. Uh, yep, armor. That's pretty great. All right, we'll go down here. We'll get this machine part going, get Pack-A-Punch going. And guys, we're, we're doing the freaking upgrade game. Oh, snap! Doctor Who shit going on here. All right, let's do this thing. We're going to Pack-A-Punch this bad boy. Whoop! Whoa! 
108 sized mag. What the shit, dude? That's not even the, the like top tier extended mag either. You can get higher ones, right? I'm pretty sure you can get a 54 gram mag as well for the M16. So I wonder what that would pack a punch be. Like, in terms of the ammo count, 108 for a 45 round mag. That's pretty crazy, isn't it? Here come the dogs, here come the dogs. Hey there, doggy doggy. You want to die right now. You want to die. Wait, where the devil are uh, How you doing, buddy? Maybe I can start ranking up my bison here. I mean, why the hell not? I've got it. So why would I... Oh, shit. There we go. That was it. All right, was that the last year? No, there's one more. Where are you, buddy? Where are you? I shall find you and I shall kill you. Oh, here he is. Hey, how you doing, bud? You're slightly dead now, sir. <laughs> okay, so even without the ring of fire, I think I just managed to four-burst the freaking boss. That's that's pretty badass. All right. And now, if I was to do this, and then, boom, dead. Oh, shit, the bed. There's, uh, there's a lot of dudes over here. Right, that's that boss guy out. Yeah, easy money, guys. Easy money. Man, we've got all sorts of stuff over here. All right, guys, we're going to start hitting the box. We're going to see what kind of stuff we can get out of it. Obviously, a ray gun is what we're looking for. If we can get it early on, I'm about to be the happiest guy in the entire world. A triple-packed freaking ray gun will literally one-shot up until wave 40+. plus. I know because I've had it. All right, what do we got? Hey, AK-47. It's decent. It's not what we're looking for, though. You suck! Yeah, you better fly out of it. All right, what have we got down here? We've got an M60, AK-47. Hey, might as well get the AK for now, huh? Okay, do we want to open up these doors, actually? That might not be the worst idea I've ever had. Being able to get through to places is great. So, how much does that one cost? A thousand. Let's do it. All right, guys. Once again, we're going to go for the end of the round, try and get one remaining, and then start hitting the box again. All right, guys. Once again, one zombie remaining. We are on round 12 at this particular moment, and... Ah, oh, hell! I didn't mean to do that! Yeah, I may need to rebind my keys, uh, because, yeah, that definitely was not meant to happen. Uh, oh. So the box is underground this time. It's in... Uh, is it the laboratory? Or where Deadshot Dakurai is. I think it's where Deadshot Dakurai is. Yeah, okay. Boss number two. Ready to be taken down. Ah, oh, oh, hell. All right, come on, baby. We can do this. We can do this pretty easy, like. We'll try and take down this boss. Ideally before the round's over. Like this. There we go. All right. Thin the herd a little bit. Yeah! Yeah, that'll do it. All right, we've got some, uh, we've got some bonus points here. And there goes that. All right, I've now not got any ammo. I hate to see it, guys. We can use a ring of fire and do this. Right, he's slightly dead. Yeah! Hey! Got some new camo challenges going. Nah. Nice. Damn it! Well, there goes the end of the round again. That's the only issue with using these blooming field upgrades and such. And, like, ammo mods. Like, a lot of the time, you will end a round by accident. You know, especially if you have things like brain rot or, you know, the ring of fire here. Ah, shit annoying, bro. See, nukes are only really good if you're in an extremely sticky situation. Other than that, you will be losing so many points if you get a nuke, right? Because, you know, you'll wipe out the zombies, yeah, but you don't really get points for it. You get a fixed 400 amount of points. Whereas if you killed all of the zombies yourself, then you're going to get a lot more points. So, yeah, bit of a top tip. Right, there we go. Max ammo. Fantastic. Very nice to see. Nice. All right. Wow, we've got 20k points. I mean, I guess if we really wanted to, we could maybe double pack this thing and still go for the box. We'll double pack it, and then we're going back to the box. Boom. Done. We're not even going to put an ammo mod on this thing because, honestly, I am tired of accidentally ending rounds, okay? So, I'm not doing it anymore. We're just going to have ourselves a regular gun. <laughs> All right, well, here we are. Yeah, here we are. Nice. I guess we could do this as well. I mean, we're not actually going to go for the D.I.E. shockwave. I don't much care about it at this particular point. What I care about is getting a ray gun. That's not a ray gun. That's a, that's a freaking FAMAS. I don't want it, dude. Come on. Ah, shotty. Okay, boom. I'll go for it. 
A lot of you guys were saying that shotties are actually really, really, really good to get. And more specifically, the spaz shotgun. So it could be a good idea to see about uh, maybe trying to grind that out a little bit. Come on! Megaton blaster! Oh, they done just got freaking wrecked! Dude, the ring of fire is so freaking good, man. It is insane for doing insane amounts of damage. It truly is. Wow. Okay. I mean, I guess if we really wanted to, we could do the DIE shockwave easter egg. Again, I don't much care about the weapon. I just want the ray gun because that shit is like fire. It really is. Would not mind it one single bit. All right, quick trip to the upgrade station. We're going to get ourselves tier two armor and upgrade this to legendary purple standard. And now we're going to go back for the box. So, yeah. Might get lucky, might not. I have no idea, my friends. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like half of this run is just going to be us trying to get ourselves a freaking ray gun. Uh, I don't much care about that. All right, moving on. A DMR. I must admit, I've never actually used it before. Uh, we've got a Krig. Ah, uh, yeah, there it is. All right. Kind of tempted to take the shoddy, actually. Uh, so give me that, and boom. Yeah, why not? Do you know what? While we're down here, I'm actually going to go buy myself Speed Curler as well. Uh, and in terms of priority, I think maybe the next perk we try and get is Quick Revive, just for the increased health regeneration. Uh, but aside from that... Just grinding this thing out like we usually do. So with Quick Revive just purchased, it is time once again to hit the box. And, okay, I don't know. Maybe we limit the box to maybe wave 20 or something, right? And then after wave 20, if we don't manage to get the ray gun, maybe we'll go ahead and buy the spaz and upgrade that to absolute maximum. And see what the fuss is about, basically. All right, come on, baby. What have we got? Another L96. Do not care. All right. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Come on. Give me a ray gun. You know you want it. You know you want it. That, that's a that's a freaking magnum. Holy shit. Okay. Okay. I can uh, I can deal with this for now. Just got the DIE shockwave from a box. Decent. All right. I like it. I like it. And eh, not really that interested. Uh, yeah, I mean, I just want to go ahead and open it up again. I will pick this thing back up, though. Ah! Even with fire sails, we're not getting anything decent. God damn it! I hate it! <laughs> I hate it so much! We're not getting anything decent from these bastard boxes. Ah! Uh, all right, yeah. Okay, that's what we're going to do. Wave 20 is the limit for regular price boxes. And then after that, if we get a fire sale, we'll try it a couple more times. But aside from that, I guess we'll have to just go for the shoddy, huh? Thankfully, I don't much care about that. Because the shoddy, as you guys keep saying, is amazing. So I'm kind of interested to try it if we don't get a ray gun, okay? Come on, something yellow. Okay, now we've got a bear. Oh, look at that. The absolute original place for the mystery box, huh? From the original Nacht to Ontoten map. Huh? That's pretty cool, isn't it? That's pretty cool. All right, so, yep. Yeah, if we don't manage to get it from this box and it moves again, then I'm just going to say sod it and we'll go for the shotgun. And then the only stipulation is if we manage to pick up a fire sale again, we'll try it once again because it's super freaking cheap. Damn it! Shoddy it is, ladies and gentlemen. Shoddy it is. All right. So we're going to do this thing. We're going to buy this Spaz 12 shotgun off the wall here. Uh, tier 3. I mean, pretty decent start. All right. We're just going to do this thing. No, 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 no. Oh, for God's sake, man. Oh, for fuck's sake. Going down early on, man. Wave 22. And I've lost my stamina up, which means I've lost my rhythm. Not cool, boo-boo. Not cool. You know what? Screw you guys. I'm using this. Yeah. 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 Eat it, you sons of bitches. All right, come on. Boom. Yeah. Not again! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! I actually almost went down there. Holy shit! 
That was almost the end of the session. I would have been so fucking pissed. I'm not even kidding. Alrighty, guys. Let's get ourselves recovered, shall we? By stamina, up, we are going to double pack-a-punch the shotgun. And then basically just keep going, I guess. And some deadshot Dakaray. Just for a little bit of bonus damage and accuracy. Always a welcome sight, in my opinion. The only one we probably won't go for is Elemental Pop. The simple reason being... The random status effect and ammo mods you get happen out of that can sometimes mistakenly end around when I don't want it to. So, yeah, basically, for now, I'm kind of swearing off ammo mods and elemental pop because I just don't like the fact I keep accidentally ending rounds. And it's just, it's just fucking annoying, basically. And ring of fire! Let's go, baby. Come on. Keep it going, baby. Yeah! There we go. Woo! We all good, baby. <laughs> Ranking off our weapon like an absolute professional. Holy crap. Oh, wow. There is a lot of stuff on the floor here. Yes, 500. Okay, we can upgrade our shoddy up to purple. Nice. Come on. Ah, oh, darn it. You hate to see it. All right. So, uh, 19,000. It's a good amount, but we're going to need 60,000 credits if we're going to upgrade both of these up to triple pack, right? So... It's going to take a little bit. For now, let's go upgrade this to purple and then maybe refill our armor and then just keep going. So, uh, let's do this thing. Upgrade. And wait, do we want to put like random attachments on? I mean, could be a cool idea. What do you guys think? If I like keep doing it, maybe I'll get myself like... Okay. 21. I wonder if that's like the absolute highest mag that you can get. Hey, more camos, guys. The drenched camo for 2,000 XP just achieved. Very nice. Okay. Oh, God. Get away from me, sir. So, I think in terms of the Road to Dark Ether episodes, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do various ones. Oh, wow. Look at that. 2,500 kills. That's the pure kills camos done. Very nice. Anyway, what I was saying is in terms of the Dark Ether episodes, what I think we should do is obviously, yeah, we'll dedicate the entire episode to one weapon, but I feel like we should only do episodes if we're going to make like a serious amount of progress or we get a gold weapon because, you know, either of them would be very, very nice, huh? Oh, double points. There's only one thing to do at a time like this. Look at the points, guys. Look at the points, baby. Oh, shit's going crazy. <laughs> oh, baby. That was a lot of points we just got. Wow. Holy crap, bro. <laughs> dead, dead, dead. Come on, we've got to be approaching the end here. There we go. One zombie remaining. Guys, we can go for triple pack. Absolutely fantastic. 8,400 headshot damage. Near as damn it. This thing isn't even won the standard yet, guys. I'm excited. Alrighty, guys. Wave 30. Here we are. Still going strong. Getting close to being able to triple pack our shotty here. But uh, yeah, still got a little bit to go until we can get either of them up to wonder standard, which is kind of sad, but it is what it is, isn't it, my friends? I love the fact that we basically have a UAV. I think that's so cool for identifying where people are. You know, if you ever have, like, one stray zombie somewhere on the map, it's just nice. It's nice being able to see where they are so you can kill them and get the next round going. Well, 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 ladies and gentlemen, the momentous occasion has come. Not only can we triple pack this thing now, we can also upgrade it to Wonder Standard. Oh, snappity snap shitty snappers. Oh, I'm, like, I'm excited here, guys. All right, let's do it. Boom, done. Eventually, I'll be able to get myself triple armor as well. That'd be fantastic. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. That was kind of nasty. Ooh. Is it 40,000 damage I'm seeing or just 4,000? I can't honestly tell. The floating damage numbers, they like go inside each other. Oh, man. Any of you more eagle-eyed viewers, let me know. Let me know what the highest amount of damage you've seen out of these guys is. Once everything has been upgraded and I don't need to buy anything else ever again, then yeah, I'm probably going to go ahead and put the weapon mods on, you know? Speed up the rounds a little bit, get some zombie rock, get some other stuffs going as well. I think it'd be a good idea. You know, just for now, I don't want to accidentally end rounds because I'm still upgrading stuff and I need time 
to upgrade the stuff. Hey, I wonder how much damage this thing will do with a ring of fire. Um, 61,000? Gosh. But, but not a lot then. Not a lot then. <laughs> <laughs> Two birds, one stone? I just got an achievement. Wow, okay. I haven't had an achievement in this game in a fair while. It must have been because I killed both of the split dudes in one foul sweep, right? That has to be it. Man, that's kind of cool. All right. Boom! Oh my god, it just rained zombies, guys. <laughs> god damn. Oh god, be careful, be careful. Doggy, go away. All right, let's see if we can hit this. Boom, done. We hit it. Okay, coolio, coolio. Anything yellow? If it's... Is that yellow or is that orange? It's yellow. It's orange. Okay, which means it's a wonder standard weapon, but not quite what we're looking for. We need yellow. We need a yellow gun to pop out of that thing, ideally. Yeah! All right, come on. We've actually got a, a pretty decent chance here. Uh, okay, not that one. Go, next one, next one, next one, next one, next one. Just keep going, keep going. If we get a ray gun, oh, I saw it, I saw it go past. I'm so sad. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This will be probably the last go. Okay, that was the last go. No, 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 I'm on my M16. I'm on my M16. Oh, hell no, dude. We've lost our stamina up again. That is not good news. That is not good news. Ring of fire. Come on, baby. Don't mess me up now, boys. Oh. Shit. Oh, my God. Oh, this is getting a little too much for me. Come on. Come on. Come on! Maybe if I do a little nady nade with insta kill. Yeah, sort of does a good amount of damage. Come on. How about that? There we go. Okay, that did a good amount. That did a good amount of damage. Holy shit. Right. If I can somehow get one person remaining, we might be in for a chance, okay? Okay, we just about got out of that one. The only thing is, if I buy another self-revive, I'm going to put myself back below the point where I'm able to upgrade ourselves up to Wonder Standard. But you know what? I think that's a small price to pay, guys. Whew! Okay, guys, we are just about there. We're, we're ready to do this thing. We're ready to completely max ourselves out in terms of upgrades. So let's start off here with the Elemental Pop. What I think I'm going to buy is Zombie Rot for... Hmm... Zombie rot for this, actually. I feel like that'd be a good way to go. And then for this one, we'll go for... We'll go for Napalm. Why not? How you doing, buddy? Good to see you, man. Good to see you. All right, let's do this thing. So, 1160. We can now get this thing up to Wonder Standard. But uh, in terms of getting ourselves up to this, we need 250. We need another 90 parts. Well, if I wasn't excited before, I'm definitely excited now. Check it out, guys. Triple armor. And we buy Deadshot Dakarai. We are literally... Armed to the teeth. For those of you guys unaware, there is in fact a, a dark ops challenge for that. Literally maxing yourself out. Two triple packed top tier weapons along with triple armor and all perks. Like that's a dark ops challenge. So there you go. Little 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 tidbit for you guys. Extraction ready. Not quite yet though, my friend. Wow. For getting to wave 41, you get three Ethereum crystals. Man, I fully imagine by the end of this, I might even be able to upgrade every remaining upgradable thing to max. No, 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 no! <sighs> Fuck! <sighs> Keep getting caught against trees, man! How do you get caught up against the tree? It's a fucking circular thing! I don't understand, bro. Let me out this corner! Let me out the- I had the ring of fire that should have killed them! Fuck! I'm so fucking sad! How? How 
did I not kill him? He must have had like no health at all, bro. Oh, I'm not happy with that ending. I'm not happy with that ending at all, bro. Oh, damn, we got a lot of stuff unlocked there. Look at that. Wow. 100 grand milestones, ringleader medals. A lot of stuff going on, guys. A whole bunch of levels up. That's pretty good. And 109,000 XP. Okay, cool. Well, at least they fixed the bug whereby the, the levels show differently. So, yeah, level 38, level 38. It's fixed. Fucking finally. Right, okay. So, let's check out our levels real quick. This is now level 22, which I'm pretty sure means we have access to more camo challenges. Uh, oh, right, zombies, yeah. Uh, elite eliminations. Weapon XP in this game is just insanely low earning, isn't it? It's an insanely low XP earn rate, especially in zombies. You know, multiplayer is obviously a little bit quicker, but in zombies, it's just ridiculous. I really do hope that you get double weapon XP tokens in the season battle passes, because if not, then... Fuck, dude, this is going to be a hell of a slog, isn't it? Damn. All right, let's check it out. Let's check these things out. Holy fuck. Wow, we got 25 of these things? That's crazy. All right, let's go and just up let's just upgrade all of our weapon classes. Okay, they're, they're all maxed now. They're all maxed. These are all maxed, which means it's literally just these bad boys. Okay. I like it, I like it, I like it. 15. Is that going to be enough? I think it is. Holy shit. We did it. Everything's maxed, guys. Weapon classes. Three, 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 three. Okay, good. Field upgrades. All done. Perks. All done. Ammo mods. All done. Ladies and gentlemen, we've maxed everything. Does that mean we've essentially completed zombies? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Not too bad, guys. Not too bad. Thank you very much for watching, my friends. That will wrap it up for our first high wave attempt. We got to wave, what was it, 41? We didn't do too bad, all things considered. 41 is not too bad. I would have loved to get 50 with an X-Fill. But sadly, luck was running against me. The ray gun just did not want to present itself to me. Maybe in future runs we'll get luckier. I don't know. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Let's got to wrap it up. If you have enjoyed today's video, you guys know what to do. Drop a like rating. I very much appreciate it. Hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to ding that bell if you haven't already. So you don't miss out on my future Cold War Zombies content. But for now, my friends... Thank you very much for watching. And as always, my friends, if you guys have any hints, tips, or suggestions for how to do well in the higher wave rounds, then do let me know in the comments area down below. I'm always down to take on your suggestions and uh, see what happens. But for now, my friends, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Thanks for all of your beautiful support. I truly appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time.